So today is Saturday, December the 2nd. We are here at the Eater Willett Park. After some controversy, we finally had a replay of the semi-final match between Charleston Primary and the St. James's Primary. And in that game, Charleston Primary won that game two goals, one goal to nil. And now it means that third places, the third place will be determined tonight. It's going to be first game up on this grand final night. It's going to be St. James's Primary in the red. And they'll be coming up against a cool looking Jason Leibert Primary in the purple. Uh, so the coach is making their final team. Um, selection. I guess the team will be announced shortly. And I think um, St. James's would have done that already. It's the third place matchup. It's going to be exciting. And then we're going to have the grand finale. It's going to be Charleston Primary coming up against St. Thomas's Primary. And that's going to be a ring dinger. So stand by for real excitement coming up. Well, we're going to have the grand entrance by the athletes or the footballers. They're going to come from the pavilion end area. The referee Odin directing traffic. It's official. It's the third place matchup today. And it's going to be St. Yeah. James's Primary coming up yeah. against the Joyce and Labour yeah. Primary. Crowd uh -huh. building up slowly. Um, a little later, I could tell you it's going to be a massive crowd here and that's going to happen not long from now so we're going to have the FIFA anthem and then the national anthem I think they're going to march out to the FIFA anthem so that will be played first, I think. And then we'll have real action. So we are asking each and everyone to stand for the national anthem of St. Kitts and Nevis.
welcome to the third place, fourth place playoff match. He had ETW Park between the Joyce and Live Primary School and the St. James Primary School. Here's the starting lineup first for the St. James Primary School. Number three, Aidan Geja, captain. Number zero, Nigel Webster. Number two, Adrian Douglas. Number four, Caleb Mills. Number one, Junicia Wilkinson. Number 10, Austin Williams. Number nine, Tisha Sean Thomas. Number seven, Alana Arthurton. And number eight, Zanye Minton. Starting lineup for the Jocelyn Leiber Primary School. Number 11, Danny Lowe, Captain. Jackie Morton, Samaria Arthurton. Number five, Keon Elliott. Number 19, Keandre Elliott. Number two, Stefan Codner. Number 16, Zinde Maynard. Number 15, Daniel Campbell. And number nine, Ryan Marta. That's why I don't call names. Because he more brighter than me, you know. No matter when A level and so when college and distinction and then kind of thing and so but that's why well, we are uh, about to music. have the start anyway, of this game the three officials out there place. and the action should be starting momentarily it's all about third place um this particular game third and fourth joyce place and here. labor primary it's the primary school the st james don't primary the school the bar, the popcorn they got hot dog they got chicken wing and the coolest jinx in Charlestown. Want to big up the big people bar? VIP section. Want to say special good afternoon to my friend Skidder. He's here. He should have been in the finals, but I don't know what's going on. Game should be starting moment. Don't forget that half time. We're going to be having a half time show. Two minutes past six. We should be starting now. Looks as if Jason Ebert Primary will have the first touch. So witness the kickoff. Action is on, folks. And right away, kicking towards the goal. St. James is under some pressure there immediately. Trying to clear that area now. Jason Ebert Primary still going forward. Jason Ebert Primary still going forward. Um, very attacking we'll see early very goal early here. in this game. And the goalkeeper nope. comes out and grabs on to it. So... Lots of advice from the coaches. Good, strong goal kick that from the St. James's primary goalie. He really played well last time and uh, trying to pressure the defense there for um, that's low Close heading there. But um, trust me, this is going to be interesting with um, Williams trying to latch onto it. Good defensive work by number 12 for Jason Levitt primary. A little knee there for number 15. Doesn't control. And the ball is going towards the line. It's still in play though. And uh, there's a little touch again. Now moving forward. Oh, St. James is with a run too. Oh, we see your early goal here. Here's a possible chance and doesn't get to latch onto it. But it's still inside that danger area. Finally cleared by the Joyce and Labour number 12. 12 Ginger that was real close, I thought. With um, St. James is applying some serious pressure at the top. Now there's a flowing, so he's still in that dangerous area for, for Joyce and Labour. Now clears it, but I am response there by St. James's. The ball may have been knocked out. Out it goes. So, coaches would be shouting the instructions, trying to make sure that the players are right on point with what they want done. So it's going to be the flowing. There's the flowing for St. James. This St. James is applying serious pressure. Now he's going to try to oh, defensive there, work there by, by Justin Ebert. But um, still setting up the play here is um, St. James's. The defense for Justin Ebert working overtime. But Williams seems to be going clear. Stop nicely there by the female. Good work by number 16. Good aggressive work. And now, Joyce and Abbott pushing forward. 
Williams makes sure he gets to the top and clears the danger right away. Now good work again. That defense for Joyce and Edwards is working over time. That number 16. It's going to get, be hard to get past her, definitely. Now on the run here, Justin Lever looking serious on the right flank. And uh, there is a shot, well, I can't say at goal because it's so far away from the goal. Definitely wasn't a shot a on goal, but an attempt nonetheless. Mr. Pini with his placard displaying some things, but I can't say. But anyway, just look for Mr. Pini and check out his placard. That's all I'm going to say. So, it's going to be a goal kick now for the St. James's primary team. Goalkeeper gives it a nice right booter. Um, on the left flank it is, on the left flank, trying to keep it in now. Fails, I think it has gone out. So, it's going to be another throw in. Trying to go forward once more. Still outside. Now, the throw in once more. Yeah, this, I, think, I think that was a handball, no? No handball. So, St. James is trying to come forward. Joyce Lebert primary defended. Joyce Lebert primary going forward now on the offensive. Nicely defended by St. James's. Um, William shakes one. Moves away to Still, his right. nil, nil. Still hooks again. Passes off now. Back in the center. Man, directs in the middle of the field. Joyce Lebert primary. He's going forward. He's going forward. He's going forward. He's going forward. Almost. A solo run. It was a bit of a solo run. Maybe should have asked for some help there. Now Joyce and Lebert primary looking busy. And the defense for for St. James's clicks in with Williams. He's a much bigger lad. Now that number 16, that lady, she can't they can't get past her easily. Drives it into her foot actually. So it will be a throwing now for the St. James's primary team. We already seen some intense play here in these opening exchanges. Now that female looks, she's going to drive it out. She does, but into the... Then there's a drive by number eight. Now low pushes off nicely. They're pushing forward, looking aggressive, pushing forward. And I think it's the female for St. James's on this occasion, defending stoutly, knocking it out. So it's going to be a throw in now for St. James's. And Just want to say special good evening to the coach of the Charleston Primary School, quickly. my good friend Puck. So they say Puck is the coach this afternoon, I mean this evening. Here's a point. And the score is still nil nil. To turn. Williams trying to rush through. Good defensive work there. And the whistle goes against St. James's. And again, Seems like the team in the they're, just the better defending ball in terms of stoutly. they're defending stoutly. Um, Jason Lebert, here's a big kick. No, that's a good kick. That's on target. But the goalkeeper bubbles with it. Wow. And he almost took it away from him, that youngster. But he grabbed it. On the second attempt, no. Jason Lebert, sorry. St. James is trying to come forward, but low. Defending stoutly, knocks it further on the right flank. He keeps it in. How does he deal with it? Still going on the right flank. Williams is all over the field. He's right there. Now he's running the left flank nicely, but he's been heavily marked. And the ball has been knocked out. So... We have seen some pretty good plays so far. These early exchanges, um, a demonstration that both teams really intend to win this game. Now drives it forward. Good defensive work there, but still Could rushing we forward. And Chief rushing Jalani forward. Jason Lever primary. Drives it in. Jason Lever primary has scored. It was a serious run through that. There was intensity so in that play. And in he drove it home. GLPS. Joyce and Lever Premier scored right away. Um, driving it towards the goalie. There's Williams. And the goalie doesn't do too well with that goal kick. It might just go out, but he keeps it in. So one goal to nil. Now Williams will have to defend once more. Joyce and Lever, the prime pressure here. They're all pumped up. Now trying to run the left flank here. Pushes it now. Has it gone out? It has gone out. Pushing it too hard. So Joyce and Lebert Primary has gone one up. That was really intense play. He definitely wanted that goal. He was rushing through. Now Joyce and Lebert Primary applying more pressure here. More pressure. Can he turn? He drives. And the goalkeeper hangs on to it. But I think there was an offside whistle. And uh, the so whistle went before that kick was peeled off. So I think it was an offside whistle.
yeah. one goal to nil is the, the score. score. Is one nil in the favor of Gingerland. And it's going to be a goal kick. I know my sister Lamis Elliott is smiling, wherever she is. Here's a goal kick. Drives in straight, hard kick. <laughs> Does he keep it in? I think he may have. Has he? The ball has been knocked out by the St. James's player. But I think probably it was out before that because it, it has been awarded to St. James's primary. So it's a throw in for St. James's. One goal to nil the score. It's not a throw in, it's going to be a kick actually. Kicks it now. And uh, Joyson Leibert gets into the ball. Number 12 pushing it through nicely. Can the little man turn? He's a busy. 1 1 is the score. Very in the interesting first half here. Very interesting first half, I can tell you. Here goes now. Action a plenty. St. James's Primary looking to go forward once more. Just on the current has gone off and came back on. So, how do they deal with that? <laughs> the current came off, and how do they deal with that? It was. <laughs> It was like a bloat and then back on in a hurry. Now, how does the referee deal with that? Suppose he had scored in the dark. What would have happened? That would have been the best time to score, really. Goalkeeper can't see. Well, that was interesting. On the right flank now. Fails to keep it in. Here, the action continues. He drives. Goalkeeper, it's in that dangerous half for Jason Lever. He clears the danger quickly. That's good work. Now they are right. offensive and. Uh, Thank you, Mr. Abbott. Here's the goalkeeper under pressure. Under pressure is the goalkeeper. Could we get a second goal goalkeeper here? Goalkeeper is under pressure. Oh. Has it gone in? Has it gone in? Score. It has gone in. Good. Jason Lever, Premier score. scored. Two goals to one. What a game we are having. Two goals to one. Yes, and, and the we score are still is two one. Half. What a game, game we are having! Line. What a game we are having! Is that a handball? Well, it almost looked like a handball. This but game looks like you have a lot of goals. Applying pressure once more, just in the neighbor primary at the top, and uh, trying to defend there. Williams shakes one, shakes him again, passes off now. He tries to keep it in, swings it into the center of the field, and taken away by Joyce in the primary. That looks like low, pushing forward. There's a, and the ball has been knocked out. It's going to be a corner kick. So what a game, what a start. Two goals to one, and we're still in the first half. Joyce in the primary, leading. Two goals to one. Uh, St. James is under more pressure with a corner kick. Good corner kick here. And uh, now he comes in to try to finish the job. He's trying to hook his way nice through. Taken away from there. him. And uh, Joyce and Ever Primary with a touch. And Joyce and Ever Primary still controlling. Boom. Well, he pretended as if he was going to boot into it. And it wow. just went away. He really booted hard into that eventually. Went away from the upright. So it's two goals to one. Joyce and Lebert primary in the ascendancy. But by the look of things, there might be more goals in this game. So if we just join it's the only in the first in half. The only in the first line. half. And we have had some real excitement so far. There's a goal kick headed by Low. And uh, trying to go forward. Joyce and Lebert primary. And uh, center, uh, not St. Thomas, but St. James is trying to control. And uh, here's Williams. That young lady is uh, coming up to uh, the goalkeeper Keep comes out confidently, grabs onto it. And I think the coaches are indicating that it should be a little bit more um, forceful with that movement. He looked a little assured, really, but a little too relaxed. But he held onto it nonetheless. So it's going to be, it looks like a free kick for St. James's Primary. It's going to be taken by number 10, Williams. And so Williams, I think, is going to try to curve it. He's going to try to go towards the goal and curve it. But it's not far, really. Nicely stopped by number 12. 
and Lo finally latches on to it. There was a bit, little bit of a delay and some missing in action kicks here and here's the goalkeeper under pressure. He looks a little too relaxed, needs to be a little bit more. I think the coaches are saying you need to rush out a little bit more with a little bit more energy. There's Williams trying to shake that man, but he's staying with him, staying with him. He gets past him eventually. Williams rushing through on the right flank. He shakes another. He crosses now in the set. And we'll it's going to be a throw in. Apparently, the ball went out. So it's going to be a throw in for the Joyce and Lever primary team. Two goals to one in this exciting exchange here in for third place. That female, that number 16, has really played well so far. But Williams, Williams, Williams. Williams again, still with the ball, pushes nice through, but key, nice yeah. work there by number 16, hard to get past, here's a possible run through, goalkeeper comes out more offside, aggressively this signal. time, Line so, one. so the whistle went, offside whistle, don't forget to check the bar, the bar got popcorn, Hot two goals to one, him. number 12 with the goal kick, low flat kick that, and uh, still with um, Jason Lever primary, Score Jason Lever primary one trying in to go forward, St. James is stopping it for the moment, Jason Lever Premier will try to turn. There's a. It's against the. Don't forget after this Jason game we're going to be primary, seeing and so it's going to be. Taking a free on kick for Saint St. James is in red, so St. James is in red, and uh, Jason Lever Premier in purple. So here's the kick. Good strong kick that. Trying to turn is Williams number ten, but he's been heavily marked, and I think. Power kick. It's going to be a free kick from close range. This is dangerous. Williams is going to go straight to goal. So let's see how strong the wall for Joyce and Lever Prime is. If it's the wall of Jericho, well, it's going to be two all. But it's a chance here. Could for, we see for St. Um, St. James? Goal here. A chance for St. James is a definite chance. They're one behind. Trying to equalize in this exciting exchange so far. The wall doesn't look good. This isn't a good wall. That wall has a lot of holes in kick it. Here. And oh, it's a very off. poor kick that by Williams. Don't forget, don't go beyond off the target. Rope. And uh, so it's still two goals to one. So. I want to say happy birthday to my yeah, friend when I call she name. She said, no, call me name. Right, happy birthday, train. friend. And uh, Jason Lever Prime is still with the ball. Say Jason Lever Prime Thomas is trying to go forward. Thomas is with an S. And uh, goes out. Water in it. Check it. Check the bar. So it's going to be a free kick. Could we see Ginger Land going up Jason three Lever here? Prime. Three one. There's a chance for them to Number score 12. here. This could be dangerous. Here goes. Nice Did it, it score? Yes, it's it a gone in. Yes, it, yes, it, it has gone in. Make that three goals to one. Well, 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 that was a super kick. It hit the far corner and then rattled to the other corner and went in. Well, well, well. Three goals to one, St. James's primary behind the eight ball. To go. So oh, the score three is 3 one. 1 in the favor of Gingerland. Joyce and Levitt Primary in the ascendancy in a big way right now. That free kick there from number 12. So here's a goal kick stopped by the St. James's player. They look a little laid back right now. A kind of defeatist attitude, except for Williams now trying to run forward, trying to do Could a we see a nice little build up here? Up here. Ooh. And uh, defending stoutly there is um, Jason Lebert looking busy. See, James is knocking the better ball to me. Here goes now, Jason Lebert. Ball has been knocked out. But from my vantage point here. So number 16 with the in the sky box. And uh, falls over. Gets a boat trade. No. Goes past. The young female stops it. <laughs> Good exchanges here. Now it's on the right flank. Passes off now. He's trying to make a run through. Trying to make a run through. He crosses. We see something going on here. There by the defender, number 10. Clears it for the moment. Trying to turn. 
No, trying to run through. Could we see something here? Solo run here. Could we see something here? Um, Williams still with a possible solo run. Here's a chance. Could we see maybe. something here? Here's a chance. <laughs> it has been cleared. Danger cleared. Good work there by Jason Lebert. Setting it up on the right flank now. Looking busy. Crosses now. Where's the goalkeeper? He grabs onto it. So it's been a precious situation here. Lovely game of football and that might be the halftime whistle three goals to one what a water game break. we are having so far i think it's the don't forget check the bar get yourself something cold to drink water break we'll make sure don't forget in the bar if they go off there's the field, popcorn hot dogs and no, the best it's chicken wing break. in town it's water break Crown building nicely so here it's a water break well, it's, a special good it's to three goals to one, one at the this point in the game Yeah, man, blessings right here at the park, you know, enjoying the game. Little wa but water break here. I have my message. Check and the my clock yard and my message if says, you know somebody's supposed to be here and they are not here. If Call CPS the telephone, broke the rules, then CPS should have lost Still the minds. match against St. James Primary School. And therefore, the St. Thomas' Primary Gingerland. School and the St. James Primary School should have been the two teams playing in the final match for first and second. I don't know all the details, stand up, but something doesn't look right. And I think whatever the decision was, it was unfair to the St. James. And I don't want to go down the line of country team and big school, but I see there was a serious level of if discrimination. You know the I'm calling the you. officials to redo this match, this whole fixture, and make the right and hard decisions. One love. Third place and fourth place right Class here. seems to be seriously part. injured because he already has his arm in a band. So that happened very early in the game. And the Red Cross, though, so they're here. Trophies thankfully. are already here. So the build-up is already here. Game the game crowd is piling into the park. Well, it actually was um, halftime. It actually was halftime, so they're at halftime. Well, the teams come back onto the field of play. And uh, the action will resume. Okay. So it was not just a water break. It was actually half time. And at half time, it's three goals to one. In favor of Joyce and Labour Prime. So the action. All right, so we're we'll back. Now. The score is 3 1 in the favor. Referee Ordain will line. blow that whistle. Don't forget, don't go past the rope. So we understand and the that, um, unfortunately, the Joyce and Lebert player apparently may have broken nice his kick arm. Nice kick-up field by Gingerland. Pressure Could here once make more. Something with the goals. So the Joyce and Lebert player fell down and may have broken his arm. They have taken him to the hospital. Well, that's mighty unfortunate. This game of football, well, games in general, any game, cricket, football, hockey, Let's see if they Ginger can, can make something of this free kick here. Pretty dangerous. Free kick for Joyce Just Lebert Prime. Just a little bit on top of the 18-yard box. Stop for the moment, but low with the touch, low with the touch, low with driving. Yeah. Oh, oh my goodness, it just went away from Ooh. the upright. Pressure again. Ooh. Pressure on St. James's. And uh, stay up, stay up. Chief Cheerleader is here. Here's the Brandy Williams. Here's the goal kick. Nice kick Three up goes to one. Under some pressure here is the defense for Jason Lebert. But they're working over time, trying to keep the ball out. Still with the ball. Nice and kick down the uh, right side. Williams. Don't forget if you want to see these the ball goes matches out. back, you can check my good there friend Mr. Borton. He has his YouTube channel. Here goes now, trying to. Where he posts stuff like this. And goes out. 
so it's going to be a throw in now. Here's a throw in, and the low with a nice touch, but maybe it hit it too yeah. hard, goes out. So St. James is number two with the throw in, and uh, kicks it forward. Williams being pressured. The See St. Thomas is warming up already. Kick here for uh, trying to clear to the warming danger. Up. What's going on? With the touch now, Joyce and Leber Primary taken away from him. St. James is defending stoutly, trying to go through, but Joyce and Leber Primary defending stoutly. Still, Joyce and Leber Primary going forward now. This could we see something nice here from Ginger Lamb? Nice and across there. Good oh boy, here. number three, the work. defender. Kick it out. Again, Joyce and Leber Primary applying nice some serious say, pressure Carter. here. And it's so let's see if Ginger Lamb can make something of this corner. More pressure. Joyce and Leber Primary has dominated most of this game. And here's the corner kick. Corner. He goes wide, not the best of corner kicks, oh. but uh, with a touch of Joyce and Leber Primary, didn't capitalize on it. The ball goes further on the right flank, and it actually has gone out. So here's the throwing. And uh, going forward now, nobody there to carry it for St. James's, so the defender for Joyce and Leber clearing it nicely. Free goes to one the score. Like, uh, here goes now, Joyce and Leber Primary pushing half. forward nicely. There's a little man, here. that little dangerous nice player. And he drives, the goalkeeper oh. hangs on to it. Serious pressure here, serious pressure. Um, <laughs> here's a Brandy Williams, is shouting encouragement, I could tell you. She's right into the game, trying to get her team motivated. They seem a little down, I could tell you. Um, at this point, three goals to one, they seem to have virtually given up the ghost. Good work there by Austin Williams and off target. Three goals to one. Get the bar, get yourself something cold to drink. So it's going to be a team popcorn. Kick. Hot dogs, Good chicken wing, the coldest drinks in Charlestown. Low. Trying to turn, fails. Yes, Kida. Going forward is Williams. Williams still being heavily marked, but trying to go forward. Being heavily marked, I could tell you. Still trying to go forward. Pick up all the big people Drives, around the big people bar. The goalkeeper. He comes out and grabs onto it. So the goalkeeper moving out quickly. Now under pressure yeah. now is the St. James's <laughs> primary goal. Oh, that's a raise. The goalkeeper hits the little man. Of target, but the little it. man is disappointed because he just and had the anxious. goalkeeper to beat, and yes, he just was off target. Well, well, well. Goal kick once more for the St James's primary. Big kick of field. It. Three goals to one. The score. Could they make use Williams of it? tries ah. a one timer. Didn't get his foot too much placed on it. He Number really 10. just tried to surprise the goalkeeper. Tried a one-timer there, but he was off target. Would have been a fantastic look if it had gone in. Because he wasn't even Seems looking. Like he just tried a one-timer. And uh, St. James is primarily making a sub. Okay, we see Charleston warming up. So... St. Thomas is warming up like they're going in for the army. Don't forget this evening, so the coach for Charleston is my good friend, none other than Puck. Charleston is the only place you can be the security one day and they just give you a promotion. You're the coach. Yeah. They said they wanted to get Uncle Alfred, but he didn't answer his phone. So they passed it on to Puck. So here's a point. Trying to go forward. Here we're going forward. It's been stopped. Once more, still trying to go forward. Nice work here, drive. Put score. Put yes, Done it in. Yes, it scores. Yes, it scores. That's a brilliant goal by Williams. Make that three goals to two. What a game we're having. A goal feast here at the ETW. Three goals to two. Yes. The supporters so, for St. James is very game happy. Here, boy. Three goals to two is the score. Three two. Ah, goals, eh? Three goals to two in this goal piece. He's gonna try to drive from there. He's rushing through. He drives way ah. off target though. 
Good intentions. Good there was intentions. a plan. There was a definite plan. To Pass it to me and then I'll drive hard. But it was off target. Crowd building up nicely, I could tell you. There's the goal kick. St. James is trying to turn drives, misses a shot. Saint so the James score is, is 3 2 in the nice favor work there, of defensive work there. GLPS. Little man with the touch, little man with the touch for, for Jason Herbert. But taken away from a bigger man, Don't taken forget. away by a bigger man, Check the bar. Austin Williams. Trying to shake, he drives, knocks it into one of the players, it goes out. So Austin Williams looking busy. Three goals to Get two. Get yourself something cold to drink. It's going to be a throwing now. There's the throwing. And uh, there's another primary trying to come forward here. The little man will turn. And the defense there. He is trying to tangle with um, Williams, but Williams is bigger than him. Now low trying to defend, trying to turn. Knocks it further onto the right flank. He is going to try a run through here now. He looks busy. There's a serious tackle there by Don't Williams, feel. knocking it out. Making sure he didn't go any further. Now here's the throwing. Handball. Handball. Definite handball. Offside. And the, handball. The, the assistant referee was very quick there. She was right on point. So it's going to be a free kick. Free kick for number 12. Kick from number 2. Number 2, sorry. There's a kick. Referee gets out of the way. Austin Williams Could pushes get a goal low out of, of the, the game? way. And uh, the defender there for Joyce and Levert Primary forcing his way through. Williams pushes him away too. It's a big pushing game here. Trying to run through here. And the defenders clear the danger. Here goes. Could he get a goal here? Equalize two. of the game? And uh, Joyce and Levert Primary goes down in fantastic fashion. And it's going to be a seven a little dangerous so for female. The young lady. I'm tripping him over. Play. And play it's on. Gonna be a free kick for Says Joyce and Ibert from pretty close range. This could be interesting. Can they Don't make it 4-2? Don't forget to check the bar, something cold to drink. Can they make it 4-2? They have always been the one to score for us. Here's the drive. Oh, that's ah. way off course. Way off target. Poor, poor, poor shot that. Goal kick. Will it come down to a tied up game and then penalties? Can that happen? I haven't seen too much of that in this tournament. Here goes now, drives. Big kick up field. Did he touch it? He drives into it. Good work there by the Justin Lebel player. The little man. Well, there's a head. Could he here. Get a goal here. Here's a Could something chance happen here? And he little still tries to drive. Back. He's trying to swing. He drives. Where's the goalkeeper? Yeah. He goes out. Crush Real it. excitement Crush here. I hope that um, Mrs. Brandy Williams has taken her pressure tablets because she's shouting her support here. 3 2 in the favor of Gingerland. Could we get an equalizer goal? Maybe, maybe not. So Let's three see. Three goals to two. Here's the kick up feet from goal the keeper. Kick and uh, nobody at the top there to pressure the, the defender. Handball. I thought I saw a bit of a handball there, but um, maybe not. Okay, the Cody referee's the right there. So Cody, Cody. here goes now. St. James is with the touch, kicks it forward. Williams trying to go after it. Williams being pressured though. Williams still trying to push forward. Je St. James goes down, no whistle. Saint, well, Big Joyce and Leibard, the nice kick there. A little too hard. The goalkeeper comes out and grabs onto it. And uh, Coach Brandy Williams says, don't kick it yet. Let the, the players settle. You know, coach knows what to do. So she gives the advice. Here goes now. Williams goes down. Just level Prime comes away with it. But um, Just level Prime looking busy on the left flank. The little man. Uh, offside whistle, I think. So offside whistle. Three goals to two the score. So three goals to two is the score. Joyce and Lebert Primary lead in. And they'll be holding yes, on to just that us here, you're witnessing third and fourth place in the primary the school football. Out. St. James's versus Gingerland. has been knocked out. Attainment section. So, handball. And that's dangerous. It's going okay. to be a free kick from free close kick range for Joyce and Lebert Primary. 
put ginger land this make use of this and what kind of wall formation Four, are we two. having here what does coach brandy williams tell them my goodness it's dangerous this could be 4-2 should be 4-2 if it's properly it has gone in it has gone in make that 4-2 It was well put in there. Goalkeeper couldn't hold on to it. Four goals to two. Jason Levert primary. Controlling this game with time running out too. Well, most of the goals that have been scored have been pretty good goals. I can't really blame the goalkeeper. There's William Strainer. One shot, but this time he's off target. Still four goals to two. You see what I tell you? Who oh, it is? Here's the kick. Strong kick. Turning there. There's another primary going forward. Kick nicely there by the St. James's player. So, normally when Joyce and Leiber Primary scores, St. James's response missed there this by the young lady. Six goals scored here this evening star. in the first game. Coming around now, swings into it. Nice Four for there. Good work by the defender. And two for St. James's. Joyce and the score Primus. is 4 2. So, here is the goal kick. See the greens, them rolling in slowly but surely. Here's the goal kick. The orange them rolling in slowly but surely. William trying to turn aggressively. The purple is rolling in slowly but surely. Down the defender for Joyce The red is rolling in Clearing slowly but surely. Quickly. Nice setting up here by Joyce Nebert. Defending stoutly. Low with a kick stopped by the, the St. James's defender. St. James is trying to go through. Peels off a right booter. And I think Williams indicating you shouldn't have hit it so hard. I was waiting to finish. And uh, kicks it out. Four goals to two, the score. Joyce and Leibold primary in the ascendancy. And time running out on this one. It's going to be another free kick or nice what's the kick. call? Our throwing. I think it's going to be a throwing. Let's see. On so it's a throwing for the Joyce and Leibold primary team. Yes, yeah, get up. Nice kick up Danger field. Cleared there. Williams, no slow Gingerland. with the touch. Let's see if they commit something at this one, two touch here. Defend. And it's against the ball. St. James's primary, so it's going to be a free kick. And from close range again, Referee that big number 12. Man, good friend I think he'll be driving to goal man. once more. Pressure once more on St. James's. It's already 4-2. And a big kick can do damage Gingerland again here. One C. <laughs> He's on target. He just has to be on target. So and it's into real the pressure. Here, yeah, let's play well Could they make something like this? It's gone in. Oh, me it's gone so. in. That's a super kick. Super kick by the big number 12. I tell you, this game will be full of goals, you know. Five two, ah. Five two in the favor of Gingerland. Five but it's not goals over yet. To two. What a game! What a goal feast! Number seventeen. And we see number seventeen going on for Jason Everett Primary. I think they may think that they have it all wrapped up. So. Five goals to two. Joyce and Leibert primary in the ascendancy. Apparently Williams was rushing through and shouldn't have crossed that line. And um, being scolded there by Odin. Um, he should wait until the ball has been kicked. And so Joyce and Leibert primary would see what the strategy was and they should be thinking about that now. Now Williams gets five to in the favor of Gingerland. Could they hold on on this score? Now 
stopped by the female who has just come on. Jason oh. Levitt primarily making waves, rushing through. Back to his nice brother. work here. Too hard. Pushes it hard now, too Williams hard. now. Wow. That asking him to stay with him. And the whistle goes. It's going to be uh, throwing, is it? I don't think they have picked that up, St. James is. So it's five goals to two. You don't forget if you're looking for me up in the sky box today. Can he score from that distance? Big match, big match. Can't go wrong. We have to be in the sky box. Want to say special good evening to the patron? Well, it was close, but well dressed. Not close enough to go to the well. So here goes now. Under pressure once more is the St. James's goal. With the little man running rings around them. And the ball goes out. Five goals to two. Joyce and Leibert primary. Totally in charge at this point. Ball. With time running out on this game. Five two is the score yeah, here. It's a throw in. And Could uh, Ginger make something of this? Leibert primary with Cross. another kick. And wow, number two. I think the nice goalkeeper was in control, two. but the young man taking no chances. Kicked it out. Oh boy, the so it's gonna be a corner kick. Problems, pandemonium in the park. Well, it's not a corner, it's a throw in. So here goes now. It's a and uh, going Lost forward it, now. Yeah. St. James is. Good stop Ginger there. Ginger Lan, Jason Leibert gets nice the one two there from Ginger Lan. Jason Leibert, Jason Leibert forcing Williams back there, but he plays the danger. And now being pressured as he tries to run rings on the right flank. The young lady there, hard to get past, I tell you. And uh, so here's the throwing. Good throwing. Trying to turn, should feel off a right here. water right away. Nice little one, two. Here's the little man struggling. Player goes down, the whistle goes, and another play is down. We have already seen a player going off with a broken arm, maybe. And let's hope that there's no more hurt, no more damage at this point. Little injury. St. James is trying to defend. It's already 5 2 in the favor of Joyce and Levitt Primary. And I believe that nice whistle trying, might yeah. be going soon. So Joyce and Levitt Primary trying to make it 6. St. James is who want to make it at least 3. If he can turn, if he can turn, he should be able to shoot oh. from there. He can't. Lots of red around him. Williams trying to go forward now. Goes wide on the right flank. But a um, oh, mm. little push down there. There's Let's no whistle. See if something could happen here. Uh, uh, cleared nice by Jason Lever Primary. Jason Lever Primary applying pressure once more. Losing it for the moment, but um, regains control. Here's a big boot. Boom. Well, a Back little side kick. Center. Boom. Nobody big kick nice response kick here. And Williams really tried to tangle with that big lady. Um, allowed to go out. So it's going to be a throw in for Jason Lever Primary. So Jason Levert primary it is. Who is gonna have the throw in? Substitution for Jason Levert primary. Everybody's gonna get a game there. So far in the lead now that they're confident. Williams goes down. I think he was pushed. And so he's gonna have a chance once more to try a fantastic. But he's from far range. It would have to be a fantastic goal. Let's see how he handles it. He's not going to try. He just passes off. He's going to try to run through. Passes off again. No <laughs> real control. And uh, boots into it. Defended there. Maybe a corner kick. So here's yeah, a chance. Yeah, we look here under a little bit of pressure here, boy. Oh, he's still in play. Still nah, in play. Williams missed the side kick. Trying to tap it in. And nah, just, just didn't latch onto it well on that the occasion. The score is 5-2. 
So five goals to two. Jason Lebel Primary holding on Turn here to so that lead. Significant the lead it is to Primary School Football Championship. Won't they be charging any money down by the gate? So Whee! it's gonna be a kick. Big kick. Big boot that. And that's the game. That's the game. It's the game. Joyce in Lebel Primary. Third place winners. Wanna say special good evening and special big ups and special thanks and special congratulations to the Gingerland Primary School for winning. Joyce in Lebel Primary winning the third place trophy. Sumero Atterton. Sumero Atterton. Sumero Atterton is the player of the match and he'll receive a San Aldo Willett Award, community movie pass, and a ball compliments of Sol. Yeah. Yeah. And we know we're trying people for, for win for